All right, I got some leads soldered up for the light and the nitrous. So one plug going into my thing and two plugs out. So these will get plugged into that. I'm now going to cut, here's my light wire and here's my nitrous wire. I'm gonna solder some bullet connectors on the end of those wires so I can plug those in. Then in the summertime, when I unplug the nitrous, I can still have my light plugged in. Okay, I got my wires soldered up. Here's the ones that will go in the main power. You see I got bullet connectors on each one. There's the ones for the light. And there's the ones for the nitro. As you can see, only black can go on black. And red, red or red can't go on black. So here's my custom intake, which cost me like thirty dollars instead of hundred and ten. The blue piece is simply a two inch by two and a half inch, forty five degree silicone turbo tubing or whatever is what they call it. It costs eight dollars. Couple hose clamps. The black wire going into that tube is for my nitrous. So that's my little injector for the nitrous. There's a piece of PVC down in there that's about a two and a quarter. Um, it's a hair smaller than I needed. I actually have an aluminum two and a half inch adapter coming in the mail, but I want a freaking ride. So that's what we put in there. Anyways, this top piece is simply a six inch tall by I think three or four inch outer wares. Um, pod filter. It comes with the outer wears cover. Just for the heck of it, I'm going to throw the timber sled uh, big old boy thing on there too. Probably just uh, use rubber bands to keep it tight. Anyways, yeah, there's your intake. Eventually, over here, this is such a big mess in here. I am going to have, I have on order some uh, frog skin to put over these holes. I'm going to drill holes here and have intakes right there too. Okay, before I put my gas tank and everything back on, I just want to show my nitrous setup. Down here, you got the nitrous bottle, the clamps, everything holding it on. I ran my hose right up through here, over to the right side, I see a zip tie that I need to clip off. It comes up through there by the muffler, then comes over and is sitting right here at the solenoid. From the solenoid, you got wires coming out the back, and you got your little nitrous tube. The most important tube on the bike. From there, I snuck my wires over along through here, and then up and under, obviously that area. Then everything comes up into the air box. Right there behind my filter is a whole mess of wires and the controller. All, everything's plugged into there. The battery's plugged in to here. My light is also plugged into those wires, as you saw earlier. I've got my AFR gauge up here. I hit it in my uh, bar pad. There's the magic button. And I just hope to heck I plugged everything up right. Right now I'm gonna put the gas tank on and just start it up and see if it's working. I forgot to mention, I did have this oxygen sensor welded into my pipe by the motorcycle shop here in town. Plaza Power Sports, thank you very much.